Hi Scorpio, welcome to my channel Scorpio. This reading for today Scorpio, this is a love message, a love reading for the Scorpio sign. Thank you so much Scorpio for supporting the channel. Thank you so much Scorpio for being here. If you would like to further connect with me Scorpio, please click the bell, please click subscribe. Let us see what is coming towards you, Scorpio. What is the guided message that is meant for you to know and ready for you to know? This is a love message, a love reading for the Scorpio sign, please. Let's see what's coming towards you, Scorpio. This is an open message, Scorpio. So think about your person. Think about your romantic situation. Visualize the person. I'll connect with you. I'll tap into their energy and let's see what is their truest feelings towards you, the future of your connection. If I will be able to tap into new love, I will let you know. If I can be specific or pick up a specific timeline, I will let you know, Scorpio. Let's see what's your guided message, Scorpio, okay? Oh, wow. You've got the judgment card, the ace of swords. <clears throat> what's the guided love message love reading for the scorpio sign the magician card the four of swords okay the two of cups scorpio the king of swords the three of swords the tower card okay all right the last reading it looks very scary <laughs> um all right so the first reading I'm picking up, Scorpio, is that, well, someone, it feels like someone, <laughs> I don't know, this person, they have a crush on you, you have a crush on them, but you guys are not. Like, someone is going to be explicit in terms of a romantic energy. I don't think you are thinking of this person. I think this person is... I think this person is overthinking this reading. Okay. Okay. All right. So you have a crush. Okay. Like, um, you know, it could be someone, it could be in a cafe, it could be in the gym, it could be at work, but you've got this eye. Okay. Like you, you, you have your eye, um, with someone you work with, someone online community, someone connected to work, someone connected to a place you visit. Okay. You have a crush on them. You know, like you like going to that grocery store, or that cafe or that gym, or you like going to the specific place at specific timing because you see this person, it's like, a, it's like a crush. And they also have like a secret admirer. Like um, they also admire you. Look at that. This is the queen of wands, you know, um, they admire you, but you're hard to approach. Okay. Um, someone someone who you have a crush on them and they also have a crush on you you could feel that you could sense you could sense that this person they have a crush on you okay you could sense you definitely can sense that this person they have a crush on you now i don't know maybe this is something that is that's been going on for a year for some of you guys but you have a crush on them um now this person with the last eclipse the full moon the eclipse and we're gearing towards the new month and there's another eclipse this person is going to have an explicit move scorpio like very bold um it's like they've been observing you they've been wanting to talk to you um they probably know your full details um, but they haven't really made a very big move or a very explicit, like obvious, obvious move towards you, Scorpio, and they're going to do it now. Okay. So someone, the judgment card, I don't know. I feel like this person, you don't think of them, but they're thinking of you lately. Like they're hijacking your, <laughs> your reading, like in today's reading, this person is it keeps 
it's getting into your network like i'm supposed to read you but this person's energy is like i'm gonna connect with you i'm gonna do this i'm there, like someone is practicing like um someone is practicing on how they're going to maybe reach out maybe have a small conversation with you but they're ready they're ready to be explicit and to be honest with you scorpio they have a help so this person you know i'm seeing like this i'm seeing like a storyline where you go to the gym or you go to this place and you say hi to a specific person you get along with this person and this person is connected to that secret crush so that person knows that this person has a crush on you and they're giving the boost of confidence like you know what just approach scorpio so someone is they could be telling, you know, they could be telling the other people there, you know, you know what, that customer, that Scorpio customer, that is my crush. And there's another person in there who's telling them, you know what, life is too short, just approach, small talk, you know. So they're preparing someone, you have a crush, and they have a crush on you, but it's not crazy, crazy, you know, like admirer. But it's not crazy stalking admirer. It's like sweet and cute. But this time, they're going to take action. They're going to have a small talk with you. That's the first step. Okay? Yeah. Five of Swords. Like, they've been, they've been crushing on you for six months, five months, maybe five days. Or they could be building up this energy for the last six to five days but someone is going to be very explicit explicit like you're the queen of wands like this person is going to have a small conversation that would lead to you know love love at first sight see you have a future with them so i'm telling you right now scorpio you have a crush or you know someone in a safe place they will have a small conversation you will pick up right away i'm telling you scorpio you can pick up you know like your sensory your intuitive sensory scorpio will pick up like this person is flirting this person is having a small conversation because they like me and i see you three of wands riding the wave of the conversation and smiling and giggling and the rest is history so someone is going to have an explicit like an obvious move that hey you know what let's materialize this because i feel and i know you have a crush on me too scorpio like this person is going to finally say it's going to finally say hey hi good morning hey by the way i am sunshine so officially you are introduced okay and the next time you go you're closer and getting closer and closer and by i don't know maybe during the christmas time you are going to kiss under the mistletoe scorpio you are going to be in a relationship and you will forget about me scorpio oh look at that queen of pentacles looks very festive but small talk could lead into this amazing relationship this person is ready respectful and their move towards you scorpio it was very planned it did not come up like a, an impulse they've been observing you like they've been observing you and thinking about you and the way they observe you or admire you is full of respect maybe this person they they're maybe they're religious but there's something very respectful and kind with this person like a big heart scorpio very big heart scorpio guess because if you look at the queen of pentacles in here you look very comfortable you look very you feel and look very peaceful like it's not um it feels so good to be around this person scorpio i would say you have a new love that would lead into a small talk or small conversation it starts with small conversation okay now for some of you um if you have a specific person in mind the second reading is for you now the second reading is specifically not not someone new okay the second reading this is not someone new this is probably someone you dated maybe 30 percent. it could be an ex but you're you're like you dated them 
maybe an ex. You've been thinking about them. With the Four of Swords and the Magician card, you're wondering why this person is not chasing you. Um, the Magician card, the King of Swords. You know, for some of you, you might have forgotten, Scorpio, that you're manifesting this person, but you block them. So they couldn't get into your network because you blocked them. Maybe you've forgotten about, oh, I have blocked you. I have forgotten to unblock you. So you couldn't really, they couldn't reach out because you blocked them. Okay. Um, so there's a person that you're thinking right now, which they put you in a stalemate. Magician card, they switch you in a stalemate. They put you in ghosting stalemate. Uh, they probably betrayed you with the three of swords in here something disappointing the hierophant card the seven of pentacles since the month of july okay since the month of july maybe there was an on and off between the two of you in the month of july um they've been thinking about you too you know with the two of cups in here but they're scared to make a move to reach out because for some of you guys they're scared of your rejection um this person is open into maybe i don't know maybe this person in the past there was a third party maybe there was a third party or maybe they disappointed you heavily um this person started to explore so if there was a third party they left you know they left that other person they wanted to come back to you and you know fulfill what you started they completely they've completely separated with a person that probably you know part of your third party for some of you if it's not a third party um they've been because i'm kind of picking up the recent past the latest one in the real time energy it looks like they're really ready to fully date fully launch themselves into dating and getting to know with the magician card and the four of swords they're quite sad because they're about maybe they're gonna sign up in an online dating maybe this person is really like you know what i really want to date i'm over the past and i want to be in a long-term commitment long-term relationship whenever they think of i want to date i want a long-term relationship they think of you and they feel bad scorpio because now that they're fully single or they're fully over the past they've got money they can marry you now they they really 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 want to commit and when they think of you they're sad because now that they have everything of a lover qualified lover they don't have you so someone you think is navigating between um should i just start looking for a new person because I want to be in love, you know, or should I try again with Scorpio? So they're into that because, you know, if you ask this person, they would like to offer you the two of cups, but they're scared of the rejection. It's like if they have this, you know, they've got this, they have, they have this logical, they have this, they have this thinking and feeling Scorpio that, you know what, I might just date someone new than going back to Scorpio because if I date if I date someone new that someone new I don't have any history of three of swords or third party or pain and hurt so it's easy to just start with someone new but whenever they do that you know whenever they try to replace you with a new two of cups your memories like this dove or this bird it, it flows away from the two of cups whenever they attempt to date someone new or the thought of replacing you or dating someone new they're allergic or they're quite irritated or they feel bad because they know that the, the two of cups they want is you so maybe they're trying because but they're not getting success because this this bird doesn't want to stay in the new two of cups it's one thing to go to you okay like you know they have wings like look at that they have wings you know like they can really start with someone new and date someone new but they couldn't or maybe it's not really inspiring or motivating or it's not really exciting to date someone new because their soul you know is drawn towards you scorpio like that is one of their karma is they try to they hurt you they try to replace you but they couldn't 
that's part of their karma so um you think of them but you're probably still upset or there's still a disappointment you wouldn't move like you're reading scorpio you wouldn't move like i could feel i could feel scorpio that you wouldn't move you wouldn't follow up like you know that the ball is in their court um they will be battling this energy so they will navigate back and forth to you or someone new but you're winning even though there's a part of you that maybe you don't want them back maybe you want them back maybe you want them back and then reject them you know there's like there's something like that in the background it's like come back to me so i can reject you so there's a bit of spite coming from you scorpio i'm just a reader i'm not gonna judge you okay no one is perfect we're all at some point we have some dysfunctional area areas in our system that we battle you know that we all we work on that's workable so no judgment with the tower card i would say they're gonna try again because their soul owes you the two of cups this two of cups they they owe it to you so if you're thinking of this karmic soulmate it's no longer karmic they pay the karma you've ended the karmic cycle this is like a previous person but they're coming as a new lover it's like a a fresh two of cups in the making yeah see the four of pentacles the four of pentacles is that i tried to give up i tried to forget you but my soul my feeling is drawn towards you scorpio so they're gonna try again so but this time the way they're gonna try it's more solid they're not like it feels like their karma is that okay if you're gonna try with scorpio you have to remove in the equation of someone you you have to exclusively just try scorpio yeah seven of cups um yeah the moon card they're coming scorpio three they're gonna make an effort this person will step into your life again very serious and they will tell you that look i know i have disappointed you with the three of swords but i'm really really serious right now i can commit to you please talk to me if we have a chance you know the moon card so they're gonna be very direct it's like scorpio i'm not scorpio i'm really really serious i think we have a chance i am fully divorced i'm available i don't have any anything to hide i am fully you know i'm no longer broken i'm whole and i believe we have a shot to destiny so come and talk to me because i'm really really serious we have a future talk to me darling okay so yeah they will initiate this and i think this is part of your manifestation is that well if they really want me they've got to initiate something really serious for me to look back and there you go you know the, there's a higher fun card in here yeah they're coming back as an emperor which is a good thing because you wouldn't accept them less of an emperor so this person is really pulling all of their strength and energy to face you and say i've disappointed you probably betrayed you but i believe you and i are meant to be and we have a future i am now able to give you everything i am now an emperor you will be shocked i would say you're going to be shocked scorpion how there's some there's something victorious about their voice there's something powerful the way this person's like i know i've hurt you but i'm here to redeem redemption absolution i am an emperor i can be with you now scorpio so it looks like the final call or like um it's a new cycle like um it's it, it sounded like they're also challenging you yeah it, it feels like they're also challenging you well if you want to know how serious i am talk to me give me a chance scorpio but don't just reject me without hearing me it's not fair Ooh, scorpio so be ready they're willing to fight for their love scorpio whoever this person is and that's what you want that's what you want scorpio that's what you want is that they fight for their love here they are like this person i will accept your rejection but please do listen to me first don't just reject me without listening to my proposal who i am and what i have and what can i offer you yes they have the wisdom on a they have the wisdom and experience of an emperor that is what karma can do with people huge lesson learned scorpio and very interesting 
this is what I have for you Scorpio thank you so much for supporting the channel thank you so much guys for being here if you would like to further connect with me if you're vibing you know what to do click the bell and click the subscribe button Scorpio I will see you soon again guys I will be uploading career and inspiration in the exclusive channel so I'll see you there I'll see you there later Scorpio you take care bye bye